Hello everyone, my name is Jules and welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess HD. In the last episode, we found the but the boss key. I was about to say mini boss key, but we found the boss key twice. Once was it was a pumpkin, and the other time it was goat cheese. I like pumpkins, I don't like goat cheese. And that is an actual fact about my food taste in real life. I actually really hate goat cheese. But I like pumpkins. That was kind of a strange fact. Oh, one second, I forgot to plug my headphones into my TV, so I will do that for a second. Um, perfect. Okay. I don't need to make a cut there. Okay, although we can talk to her, and what happened? Uh, what? Cheese? Uh, did husband move it? Uh, where in world did I put it? Sorry, I need thinking time. Uh, take cheese to husband. Uh, you do that. I'll try to remember. Yeah, we didn't exactly go through this room because I had to end the episode off and we started at the opening of the dungeon. Um, oh, also, one more thing that I need to know. Um, I am sort of trying to change my recording setup a tiny bit and I hope this works so I put a sock over my microphone sort of as a makeshift pop filter and I'm hoping that it'll get rid of the humming of the disc spin on the Wii U because that's been kind of an issue lately. In fact I noticed like it was a huge issue just when I looked at the whole audio thing in my recording so yeah although we can talk to him. Oh needs more punch uh uh what good smell what you have huh hmm perfect ingredient little more time on fire it become gourmet soup huh here taste huh and ah, come on you didn't say cheese i couldn't make an oblivion reference i'm gonna do it anyway I'm trying to remember that voice. Cheese! Okay, that one definitely wasn't it, but it'll do, I hope. It's been like two years since I played Oblivion. Um, yeah, we also need to heal. So now we have superb soup. It tastes quite cheesy, and I know, well, Link likes it because it restores eight hearts now. It would probably restore like, I don't know, one heart if it were me. I'm going to get some more and that way we can like actually restore energy but something that is not super hard to get or a fairy because fairies are not actually hard to get that's what we got you through last episode well we need to go okay i think that um okay oh yeah i need i'm trying to like move the map Anyway, I know we're going- I was trying to like center on where we were going. We're supposed to go the other side of the room that Yetta is in, I think. Oh no. Oh, that's right! We needed to take the cheese to Yetto. I think I remember, uh? We put key in nearby rooms, so no forgetting, uh? How I forget? Embarrassing, uh? Oh, don't worry about it, you're sick. People forget stuff when they're sick. See here, place marked by symbol, uh. I'm trying to. Okay, yeah, it's on the second floor. It there, it must be, uh. You look for me. Okay, and yes, now we can go in here. I believe. Oh yeah, we need the. Oh no. Oh, okay. Please don't kill me. Um, the free starts in this game. Like I've never really liked free starts as a Zelda enemy. It's like in um, Majora's Mask and Ocarina of Time, they're just kind of annoying. And this game, they're actually a little bit frightening. Like. Okay, we didn't really need to get rid of the mini freeze arts, but yeah, okay, now this one. Like, they sort of have a self. Oh. 
Okay. Good. Okay, we got rid of that one. Okay. Uh, I think there are ice cubes in here. I remember that there's like one thing that looks kind of like this where you have to just like... There's a puddle there, but that wasn't that one. Oh yeah, and here, um, another thing that we need the ball and chain for, we need it a lot in this dungeon. It's almost like it's the dungeon item. Um, yeah, um, there is a heart piece here. I believe there are two in this dungeon. I think there are two. There might be a third, like, if there is sort of a third one that I'm forgetting, I'll probably remember it once we get to the room it's in. But yeah, we have that, um, do we go here? No, we need a key. We need to go over here. We can't exactly use that cannon just yet, because there are those iron blocks blocking the way. Okay. Oh, and we can also see, like, a little... Oh, these things. Um, there is another way to get rid of these things, and... Um, that is the ball and chain. I still prefer the helm splitter. I just thought that I might show that off. Ooh, is this the room where we got the compass? I think it is. Oh yeah, and we can also like do that just in case we fall. Now we have a hookshot target. And I'm hearing like those keys again that attacked us out of nowhere last episode. Um, hopefully they won't kill us. Although they are coming to kill us. Um, I'll get a key. Just what we were after. Oh, nope. I don't want to fall. I thought that there was solid ground there for a minute. Um, yeah, we can just switch out to the other side. Okay. And... Oh, no, I don't want to fall in. Now we can go here. Um, I know that there is another heart piece in this room. As well as one of those things. Yeah, I want to go here partly because there is, um... Ah, what's it called? Yeah, there, there is a Poe here. Um, I don't remember which one it is. I know that there's a Poe inside the suits of armor. Oh, and there are also a lot of, like, treasure chests and stuff. Okay, uh, ten rupees. Um, I remember the Poe being on the other side, and it's probably on this side. And it's that one! Um, okay. I, I would rather not be chased by a Poe that is trying to kill me, so I will kill it. Oh, come on, come back here! I want to kill you! Even though you're a ghost, and I'm just... I don't know, do you really kill Poes? I don't know. Like, I guess that they're ghosts, but, like, what died to, I don't know, like, I don't know, make them a foe? What were they originally? Um, okay. Also, I remember that there's also, like, an ice thing. Um, like, an ice bubble. I think that's what they were called. Um, the ice bubbles in this game always give, um, orange rupees. Oh, and it, okay, we have a depressing collectible there. Yes! Oh yes, and we have an orange rupee! And I'm so used to, like, it... I don't know. I don't know what I was gonna say. Um, yeah, we don't need any lantern oil. Okay, so let's go up here. Oh yeah, and also something that I never mentioned in the last episode. The Yetis just have random pictures of just various things in Hyrule. Like, I don't know. I don't know who that is there. You don't really see them in that game. Um, I kind of want to find some more because there are some in this, um, probably in this room. Yeah, like there. Why do they have a picture of Rutella? And also this? These are the statues by the Sacred Grove. Why do the Yetis have a picture of the statues by the Sacred Grove and a picture of Rutella? I mean, like, I guess they have, like, stolen stuff from Zora's Domain, but... 
Maybe they stole this picture? I don't know. The Yeti are the Yetis in this game are so strange. Like, I mean, I guess they yeah they're they're yet they're friendly Yetis. So, I mean, yeah, but it's so weird. I don't know. Um, past PBG, do it. Do a G Files episode on it. Oh yeah. Um. Okay, I killed that fame. Okay, and this section involves a little- oh, um, I don't know, maybe I should just kill these keys first. Maybe with the bow. Oh my- why can't I kill it? Okay, good, I was probably aiming, like, too high. Okay, I got it. Yeah, there is a piece of heart on the other side there. Um, now, this thing you have to time just right, and it can get really annoying. Oh my god. Um, I, I don't really like that particular section of platforming, but I want to get all of the heart pieces, so um, if I fall one more time, I'm just going to cut when I actually do do this right. Um, okay. No, I don't know why I did that. Okay, maybe if I hit it, like, right now, as this is going back. No, that- oh my- uh. Okay, I'm just gonna cut to when I actually do that. Okay, now I'm here, and don't fall. Yes, okay. Okay, I have the heart piece, and that was, I believe, the very next try. Oh, and we only have one more until we get our 13th, or, though I guess it'll be our 14th by that point, so we're going to be getting one at the end of this dungeon. So, now we can finally press onward in our going through of this dungeon. I can't really think of creative names on the spot. I'm sorry. Um, okay, I forget what's over here. Oh. I remember what room this is. Well, I am so glad that we have the ball and chain. Although I can't really walk with it. Um, Okay. I'm gonna kill all of these Freezards. I hate Freezards. I will kill all of you! Okay, good. You're all dead. There definitely won't be like some other point in the game where I have to fight a bajillion of them with a very low amount of health. Okay, but we got rid of both of that. I mean, keys. And now there is the third Poe. Yeah, there are, um, I think there are only two Poe's for the next two dungeons. And then there are two more dungeons after that. This game is a lot of dungeons, and... Yeah, so there are only going to be a few more. How many Poe's souls do we have? Okay, we're at 38, so we, we have a lot. We only have 22 left to get. And four of them are in dungeons. We have 18 left to get that are out in Hyrule. Oh, I don't have a key. Yeah, the key is probably over here. Okay, and... Oh, this place! <laughs> Yeah, now that we have the ball and chain, we can finally step on that switch and go the final way. And we can also do that. So, 
I said this last episode, but I love, love, love Slady Block Puzzles so much. So, I'm going... To, um, there is a way that you can have both of them pressed down. We don't really need to, but since I love these puzzles so much, I'm going to do it. <laughs> um... Okay, I think I'm supposed to... Okay, I know what I'm supposed to do. I think I'm supposed to go here. Yeah, I am, because now... I can move this over... Okay, I see, I see how we do both again. Um, so I move that over, I now push this towards that block over there. And then I just have this block on the end. Can easily go back where the first one was, and then we can have all of the ways open, even though we're only gonna be using one of them. But, I love these puzzles so much. Um, There is a little side quest you can do that has a bunch of these, and I will definitely be doing that right after we are done with this dungeon, because it is one of my favorite small caves in the entire game. In fact, it is my favorite cave in the entire game. Um, okay, I don't remember. Okay, this was where Yeto is. I think that we are supposed to go up here. Yeah, because we've been everywhere that the other door went to. Um, okay, yes, I think that this is right. Okay, yeah, because we haven't been over here. Okay, and there's a place we can go there, but... I'm trying to remember, like, where we have and haven't been. It's like, I have the map, but they only have the map for one floor at a time, so... Yeah. Um, I was trying to target that thing. Um, what, what is going on? Why can't I target anything? Okay, I can target now. Um, I'm just going to have my shield up. Okay, good. We got hit, but we killed it. Um... Okay, good, I got both of them. Okay, that was not too much of a hassle. Now I can stand closer and go here. I think we're pretty close to the big key. Okay, yeah, we can go here, just have a shortcut in case we fall. I think it's another, like, chandelier platform, you think? Yeah, it is. Okay. And in the distance, why is there another, like, I don't know, like, six foot painting of Rutella? Why do you have these? And. Oh my god. We haven't been to where that painting is yet. There is no way that the Yetis could have acquired a painting of that place. And we will get to it in, like, I don't know, like, ten episodes or something. How do you get these paintings? I'll give you a hint. Um, the place where that painting is from, it's, it's very far away. I'll tell you that. Um, why are we here? Okay, I think we're supposed to go... Whoops. So I think we are supposed to go back around here because we finally have a key. Um, I'm gonna look at my map. Okay, it's probably on the second floor. 
Uh, I need to like see everything. Um. Okay, I think I know where we need to go. I think that we need to go back down here. Yeah, because there was that one place. Um, I'm just going to run past all of you. I don't like you in any way. And, oh god, no. Free swords. Two free swords. Okay, oh! Um, I'll be fine. Okay, got them all in one hit. Okay. Oh, I don't like those things at all. Oh yeah, and that's how we get past the blocks. We can just hit them with the ball and chain. And now we can use the cannon, although I think that there are cannonballs in here. I don't believe that the free swords respawn. Oh no, there weren't cannonballs here. Well, we're gonna need to get rid of that thing anyway. We are very close to the big key. Um. I think I might just end the episode off after we get it. Seems like a better stopping point than right now. Okay, I believe there was- there might have been a cannonball right around here. Oh no, I remember where they are now. They're down here. Yeah, and I guess it would have been marked on the map as red, so... Whoops, I did not mean to do that. Yeah, we have to carry a cannonball all the way from here. <laughs> oh, is this like the first place where we got them? Yeah, it is. Ooh, what's up there? Oh, a free sword. Um, now I'm gonna pull that thingy down, pick up this thingy, and place it in this thingy. And now we should have a cannonball in the room, right? Now. Okay. Oh, I kind of wish I knew how to speed footage up. This is going so slowly. Although we are here. Almost. Get there. Okay, we're here. I need to equip my bombs. Uh, one sec. Okay, and now we have the cannonball right here. Um, I've never tried, like, throwing it up here. On top of the ice things. Not the ice things, the iron things. However, I mean... They're probably... Like, the cannon there is probably there for a reason. You probably have to. I'm just not gonna try. And... Okay, we are very close to the end of the dungeon. Um, yeah, we need to aim this thing towards that freeze arc, so it's blocking the way. If we went up the ladder, it would just kill us, so... I always get worried when I go right by that crack, and I was I don't want to fall, but we do have the hookshot target there. Okay. I will kill the Freezard, because it deserves it. All Freezards deserve to die. Yeah, and there are many free swords. I'm just gonna run past them, like, they're not worth fighting. Yeah, and those are a lot of icicles. Ow. Um, yeah, for this room, um, use the helm splitter. 
It'll help you. That that is my advice. You have to fight so many of these, and also like stay in one part of the room while you are fighting some, or else you know you'll wake like. Yeah, uh, we we have waked all of them. Um, I think there are like nine or ten of them in here. Okay, good. We get we hit two of them at the same time. Ow. Okay, Mike is hit. Yes, we got two. We got hit. Um. Okay, I got that red rupee. Ow. I'll probably be using that um, soup that we got from the Yeti. I should equip that now. Okay, good. And we have more food? No, it's the actual bedroom key, so... We finally found the key. That sure took a while, but that mirror shard is as good as ours. Well, now that we have the bedroom key, this is the perfect time to end the episode off, so this has been... Let's play Twilight Princess HD. In the next episode, we are going to be going to the bedroom and getting in the mirror. There, there are going to be no strange attached, I promise. This isn't like it's a Zelda dungeon and it'll be like a boss at the end, but anyway, goodbye.